Hello my friends and welcome back to our continuing plan let's play The Legend of Dragoon for PlayStation. My name is A Butler's Bird, this is your Story Base Gaming Channel, and today we just defeated the Kraken in Chapter 4 Moon of Fate. We're here in Aglis and we have completed Aglis. On to our next destination, I have put Rose in the party uh, for one reason, mostly one reason only, and that is that Hashel has turned into 72 HP. Yeah, I would say that's bad. Uh, so we can go ahead and level up more and more a little bit, I guess, uh, before we get to Hard Blade. Yeah, so uh, let's continue on, shall we? I hope you're all having a wonderful, fantastic, amazing day today. I can't go to the door up there because Dart just shakes his head. I did try it. And we're not out of the woods yet, it seems. Probably a good idea that I got, I replaced Hashel. Although any, I can probably lock these down and get Hashel's HP back up. But at the same time, it can also work on other characters as well. So it's not like a really, it's not like a really big deal overall. I mean, Rose needs some more work. So does everyone. I gave Rose an item that increases her SP every turn. So she gets 20 SP every turn. And hopefully... You know, that's what? 95 SP per turn? Oh, she's got an instant kill blade. Well, that's kind of annoying. I wonder if I have a different weapon for her. Because I don't like instant kills because I'm trying to farm... Uh, SP and additions. I have a demon stiletto, which frightens. Drops my attack stat significantly, but it should be fine. At least fine for now. Is that a healing water? No, I can't get to it. Just following what's given to me. Okay, we're back here. This is where we made the bomb. Is that the wrong one? The mo one, perhaps? Yeah, that's the one I wanted. Then I think it's the far right one that takes us out. Alright, we got King Triton and, uh... The, uh, the Scud Shark. At least I'm nailing more and more quite easily. Uh, it's afraid, so it should take extra damage, I believe. So let's lock down the uh, Aqua King here. Afraid is also not the best because that means you do more damage, which is not something I necessarily want to do right now. Yeah, you can see how much more damage that does. But still, we can still get uh, some SP. I want to attack with you. I do need to get me more SP. I'll just heal for now. Swing and a miss. There we go. I hope those extra 20 SP does add on to the total for Dragon Levels. Because if so, that's something that I could use. Although I also have the item that increases my SP gains by 50%. I probably should be using that instead of what I'm using on Rose. I just don't want to unequip it from Hatchel because it was a little bit of work. <laughs> I'm lazy with what I say. Let's not be lazy. It'll save us time in the long run. Uh, let's go here. Um, more gods. 
There we go. I mean, what we are doing to move that uh, 75 SP? They need 20 SP versus 37 SP? 37 is better. Buckle, you are... Miranda, you are so annoying. Ack! Are other people safe? Ack! Don't say anything. Seven died. Buckle and other creatures cannot live without Seven. Ack! Can't we do something for you? Can't you be saved with a dragon's power? Answer me. Be quiet. Ack! Good night. Ack! Are you playing dead again? Give me a break. Wake me again. Ugh. Soon. Ugh. Closing my eyes. And soon. Ugh. Oh, they binded in the challenge room. That sucks. Poor little guy. Poor all the guys. Or ladies. Whatever these things are. And of course, Savan. So much death. I think I probably hit the middle one. Yep. This is a cool dungeon. I gotta admit. It's very pretty. The enemies are interesting. They're very thematic. The boss was very interesting. I mean, the whole dungeon was very cool. Not to mention, we also got the cool music. The enemies were very nice to fight, you know, one at a time. For the most part. Man, that fear just does so much damage. Yeah, fear is not a stat that you want on you, that's for sure. I think we're almost out of here. Dart. The Cal's time is stopping, Cal. I cannot roll anymore, Cal. But before that, you must see Pino. Dad, what are you doing? The moon mirror is broken. Because the signet sphere of Agalus was destroyed, it doesn't need any more, Pino. Zeke is in the lost city Zenobatos, Pino. Go hurry, Pino. But how can we go? We connected a teleport device, Cal. Please keep rolling for decal, Cal. Oh, poor little guys. He's dead. He opened a road with his last power. We don't waste your death. Poor guys. Come on, come on. Don't get stuck. I thought there would be a teleporter there. Here? Uh, -huh. Or, I, I feel like I'm missing. I feel like there was supposed to be a teleport in this room. No? No? I'm not supposed to go back the other way, are we? That would be a negative. Hmm. Like, I could have swore this white thing on the ground was going to be a teleporter. But there ain't nothing here. And there ain't nothing down here. Hey, we gotta keep moving backwards. Yeah, 
That's a lot of extra SP. Good lord, that's a lot. Alright, that doesn't get much at all. I know I just gave it a chance to attack me, but... Trying to build additions and uh, points. Oh wow, he didn't attack me. That's weird. Just literally did nothing for two rounds. Strike. Any levels? Nope. Nope, guess not. Oh, these guys. No. Rose. Ruff has been here forever, Ruff. Ruff only knows views and sounding here, Ruff. Ruff want to go outside at least once, Ruff. No. Don't worry. Now you can go out. Okay, Ruff. No. It's rough, rough. No, oh, little guys. These babies are dead too. So their death won't be in vain. We have to move on. Well, that's true. These babies completed their own duty. We have to do as well. Oh, poor little guys. Uh, shark, yes. Wow! You don't get overconfident in this game. As soon as you start saying things like, wow, you never miss this edition, you miss the edition like the next time you try it. Nice shot. Physical attack bear, fantastic. Just bang my head against that. Edition. All right, you can go ahead and lock this down. Edition training. That's really good. Got an extra edition out of that on both of the characters. Running, I hit it. Come on, Rose. Dead. Oh, it's still alive. I got one more attack. Continue moving backwards, I suppose. I think it's all the way, actually, yeah, I think it's all the way to the back. Pretty sure it's all the way to the back. miss his first attack when I miss with him. I know I missed his second attack before too, it's just the first attack because it always seems to be the hardest. 
I don't know why that is. I guess it sets the tempo for the additions. Good, Dark. Dark got an attack off before it could hit me. Alright, Albert, uh, go ahead and lock this guy down. You're also missing a lot of HP. You got Rose level HP. I'm almost at the beginning of this dungeon. So I should be able to find the, uh, find the, um, a healing spot outside when I go back to the town. I thought it was feared, and now he's not. Weird. Maybe he's immune to it? I could have swore the uh, things appeared over his head. Maybe I just wished it happened or thought it happened. I don't know. It's not a big deal. This Minotaur is great to train on. He's got so much HP. This way, I believe. That was the correct way to go. I think. Stuck. Stuck. Yep, that was the right way to go. This must be the door to the teleport device that Kyle was talking about. Oh, yeah, I remember this door. And it opens. It looks like the one in my forest. This can take us to Zenobathos instantly. It's completely different. Wingly has had such astonishing magic power. Moving between cities instantly like this. <laughs> it's astonishing, all right, but I can accept life being generated by magic. Me neither. It's too depressing to be born just to do one thing. The Varge embryo that guided destruction was born for destruction only. Its existence might have the same sorrow. Then let's try to make it feel better. By making sure it will never be born, we gotta protect the next signet sphere. Let let's go to the lost cities and abathos. Warped is Ooh, that was a cool little and uh, whatever that's called, like animation. Yeah, sure, why not? Question is, is this gonna be another dungeon or is this gonna be a town? Because I really need to rest somewhere. So this is the Lost Cities and Abathos. It is the city where the legislation and administration of the world of the ancient Wingleys were carried out uh, it's a nice city, please. It seems like a place Albert would live. Yes, I have great interest in the way in which they manage their nations. However, I don't think I can learn anything from such a mess. It fell more than 10,000 years ago. Warning, 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 warning. Warning, Xenobastos is under martial law. Leave the city at once. Good for you, Albert. It seems that Zenobathos is still alive. Warning, invaded by humans, take shelter in Cadessa promptly. Warning, 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 warning! However, unfortunately, it doesn't seem to be functioning. Are those generated by magic too? It seems like it. It's different from Buckle. There's no heart in it. It is, just like Zeke now. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, that's cold. Hey guys, there's something coming this way. What the 
had this giant manta ray. I know they call those things sharks. They look like manta rays. What's this? I am Cologne. I will be your wings. Savan was talking about his last moments. Wings that can fly the skies will be given. It was about you. Rows of people who are carrying the world. Although Savan could accomplish his objectives, he fulfilled his role at the expense of his life. Not everything is on you. I know. I will stop my father and fulfill Savan's will. I'll be here waiting for you. Whenever you'd like to go back to the world, I'll be your wings. Would you like to have wings? Sure, let's see what you do. And look, it's like a flying manta ray. That's so cool. So now I can go back and get all the all the things I missed, right? The question is, does the manta ray go away? Or can I summon it? I can summon it. Oh, <laughs> yes! All right, well, I'm gonna go around and get all the stardust that I haven't gotten. I think I'm also going to do some sessions where I basically just you know level up additions uh, fight low-level enemies and try to get some stuff done so the idea is not really to grind for exp but to grind for you know numbers also dragoon level numbers because I have a lot that still needs to be Done. Hard blade, five wing shadow, hex hammer. I mean, there's what 160, uh, 240 minus four, 236 additions I need to do with the Hashel before I unlock his level six. That's insane. Uh, you need 10, 20, um, 58, which is 78 to get your final one. Mero, I'm just waiting on levels. Congo already has his. So so it's like the one that I really need to focus on is Hashel. Uh, basically, just speed him up and just have him kill everything. I guess that's the plan. Maybe I go kill manatees in the desert. Because that seems to be a very high amount of enemies that you can quickly get. And there's not a lot of usually other enemies that come with it. So you just, you know, get a manatee, slow it down, and just... Have him punch it. I guess that's what I could do. But yeah, I'll be back in... Well, for you guys, it's going to be like a moment. For, for me, it may be a couple hours. So yeah, I'll see you soon. Today, we're about to do something that may be a little bit dumb. But we're going to do it anyway. Because why not? Uh, first thing you'll notice, though, is a couple of changes. For one, you'll notice my gold is at 22,000. My lord, I killed a lot of sandworms. I, I, I completely eliminate the entire species of sandworms. Uh, and in doing so, everyone except Dart has their final edition. Also, you may have noticed as I scrolled, every single person also has a dragon level 5. Yes, I killed a lot of sandworms. Now, what you may not notice though... Is Dart isn't level 35 or 36, so what's up with that? Well, what I ended up doing was I killed Dart. Here, I'll show you what I basically did. So, this is kind of how the fight went. The fight went like this. I would uh, basically Signet Stone a Sandworm. And then after that... Dart would die because of his weapon. And then I would increase my... My additions, which I totally failed on that one. But yeah, that's that's kind of how I've been playing for like the last six or seven hours. I've just been killing sandworms and the dung beetles non-stop. In order to increase my power. 
And uh, because Dart was dead, Dart never really gained any experience. And because Dart never gained really any experience, uh, Dart's level is now almost exactly what Kongo's and Meru's are. So if you see there, 58,000 experience. Kong uh, Meru has 57. Kongo has 57. So basically what that allowed me to do is allow me to catch up my other two characters that I want to take to endgame with me to Dart's level. And I got all the additions to Dragon Levels. Oh yeah, there's something stupid. We're here in Veilweb. Because we were told to come back here. A, I need to get the 50th Stardust, which is somewhere in here. But B, there's other things we need to do. Rose, visit me again, but my power's at its limit. Please save the souls of the four dragons who are our companions. Surely, you had done well. But we have to pursue Zeke now. I will trust you to save the dragon's souls. So, are we allowed to do that now? Like, is that a thing that we can do? Maybe it is. Uh, yeah, the reason Dart's additions aren't max is because he's been dead. So, yeah, um, that's, that's why. <laughs> oh my god, like I said, it took me, uh, so I haven't been feeling quite myself lately. Uh, there is a really, really big bad storm brewing, not too far from where I live. And it's kind of got me a little bit bummed, you know, worried about friends, family, and all of that. And, um... Darn it! I, I've been getting so good at that. I want to show you her full, uh, her full, um, addition. But yeah, I, I've been a little bit... Man, I can't do additions all of a sudden. I, I've been a little bit bummed, I, I will admit. And... To, to handle that, I just... Grinded Legend of the Dragoon. Like, all day long. I got home at around... 4 p.m. And I grinded till, I don't know, 11 o'clock at night. Yep, just, just, just did it non-stop. There we go. Told you I could do it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's some better way. I'm pretty sure there's some better way to level additions and Dragoon levels, but heck if I know how. Uh, right or left? Normally left is always right, but this is center. So let's go center. I think here. But I, I could have... We can see the road we took all the way here. I never imagined we would make it all the way up here. There's a small hole in the middle of the way. This must have come off from here. Yes! There it is! Stardust 5-0. We have every Stardust in the game now. How about that? I don't really know what I'm going to do with all the money that I grinded off for Santa Worms. I, I honestly don't have a clue. I, I could go to buy some really expensive stuff, such as like the helmets. Uh, I could make one of my characters basically invincible. I don't know if that's going to ruin the fun of the game, though. Nothing has changed here, not even a bit. I think I could probably buy the helmets, though. Because the helmets don't seem to be, I mean, compared to what I'm using now, not that much better than what I'm using. Sayaville, it is such an irony that you who study life and death cannot die completely. Ah, uh, the Wind Dragon, looks like. Is that you, Rose? Is anything wrong? You brought Tickle to guest with you. I was asked by Shirley and came to see how you're doing. How are you? How are your studies? Through the subjugation of Mayfell, I think I completely understand where life comes from and where it goes. Wingleys have been manipulating souls, namely the life, from Mayfell, the place they known as the Death Capital, and the Crystal Palace known as the Life Capital. We saw in Mayfell the destination of life, the darkness opened up into hell. The world is shadows without light. That is why you cannot die completely. I don't want to go to a world of nothing spread out on the tip of darkness. I don't like nothingness. 
Where should I go? I'll tell you now. Oh, okay, we're doing this. Sounds like boss music too. Well, that is definitely boss music. Yeah, we're fighting one of the wind dragons. Seer Veil. Okay, is this really a smart idea for us to do this considering how... How, um... I don't know. I mean, maybe we can. I was thinking that maybe we're under level to do this. Maybe we're supposed to do this at the end of the game or something, but I, I think it's okay if we do it now. Let's first launch a, a speed down. And then we're gonna launch a power down. Uh, then we're gonna launch a power up. I actually have a weird strategy that I wanna try out here. And that weird strategy is the special with Congo. That way, Meru is not nerfed by Dart's special. Although, does Earth weaken one of those two? I don't know. If you are wondering, yes, we are going to see all the Dragoons. I mean, all like the uh, the super spells. I, I, I will make sure before the end of this series, we see all the final editions and all the super spells. Don't worry. Now is not a time to use the super spell though. Because, uh, yeah, Golden Dragon just doesn't make sense on this guy. He's all alone. Are all his spells all? Yeah, they are. How about that? I didn't even notice that. Kind of sucks to have especially with him, though, because... Well, I mean, normally I could do his special. That is a lot of damage. Please don't do Blossom Shield. Or whatever that is. Okay, that is not Blossom Shield. That is an attack. I don't mind attacks because he's powered down. You see? I don't mind that. Blue Sea Dragon. I can't wait to cast that. The problem is if I cast this, it's... I mean, I could cast this three times, I could cast this once. Plus, I want to make sure I have heals. Now, this is 50% all, and this is 50% singles. So, uh, maybe it's better if I use this attack. I'm sorry, I missed how much damage that did. 1284, wow, oh my god, that's a lot of damage. Heck yeah. A little magic wonder. And don't forget, uh, Congo is uh, powered up right now, so he should do the most damage. Ah, that's that's such a nice balance, though. Both of them can use their very strong magics, while Congo just goes to town. Oh, this, this is, this is, this almost seems unfair. Oh, oh, he's fast, never mind. I was gonna say it seems unfair with how much we're kicking his butt, but no. Wow, we are so freaking strong right now. This guy is really tough too, though. 
I'm gonna hit him for what, 5,000 damage? And he has not even budged. For some reason, I seem to do less damage. I'm not really sure why that was. Could I go ahead and just launch a golden dragon? I mean, does it, is, it, is it really such a big deal if I don't? Let's do it. Why not? I mean, he's powered up. He, he, this is going to do the most damage it's ever going to do. Plus, he's earth and this guy's wind. So, go suck an egg. giant tank that falls from the sky I would call it ruby weapon except it's yellow <laughs> I sucked him in and fired him out oh my god that was amazing and that did a lot of damage too a lot of damage he's almost down now So uh, PlayStation just had a uh, update on new games coming out, and surprisingly, I, I never saw this coming. They announced a Lunar Remaster, Lunar One and Lunar Two Remaster, much like Suikoden and One and Two are being remastered. I adore Lunar One. I love Lunar One so so much, and I was. I, I, I'm not gonna lie, I'm, I'm a little bit mad about this remaster. And the reason I'm a little bit mad is not because it's being remastered. I think it needs to be remastered. I am super happy to remaster. I'm a little bit mad that it's being remastered because after Omori, I had every intention of playing Lunar 2. But now, with the remaster coming out, playing Lunar 2 just seems not like a smart idea. I mean, I'll be emulating it. So there's probably going to be issues with playing the game. Uh, the original Lunar, I did not emulate. I played that with original hardware thanks to a friend who had the disc. But I don't own Lunar 2. And he doesn't own Lunar 2. So instead of emulating, I wait for it to come out. The only problem is Weekend is also going to be coming out next year, which is just too many games coming out once. Ooh, this is pretty. I mean, this, this guy's going down fast, so... Let's see what we can do a yippee. Ah, I'm sorry. Sorry, Kyle, I tried. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm a little bit frustrated with that because I really, 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 really want to play Lunar 2. And I'm going to have to wait for it. So the question, I guess, is if I'm not playing Lunar 2 after Omori, what the heck do I play after Omori? I, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm kind of left with a giant question mark on that. I mean, it's the the way I've done the. Uh... Oh my God, that was amazing! <laughs> I literally had to stop mid sense because it was so dang cold. <laughs> Oh, that was amazing! Uh, wow, that was really, really cool. But anyway, uh... Yeah, I mean, if I'm done, uh, when I finish Omari, I'm not really sure what to play. Uh, I mean, part of me wants to, uh, dive back in the world of Shadow Hearts, and I've been talking about Kudelka a lot. Especially since my, uh... My bro, my boy, my bro, my friend, my amigo, my my compadre is Zappa, king of giant robots. Uh, he's been doing uh, Shadow Hearts on his channel, and I've been co-hosting it. Did you hear that music? That was amazing. So he's been doing uh, Shadow Hearts one on his channel, and. I really think playing Kudelka is what I need to do next. Like, there's a part of me that wants to 
played through some of the series I played on the channel. And I want to play Shadow Hearts 3. And I really want to play Kadelka. So I'm leaning towards Kadelka. Although I could always possibly play a game that was recommended via the, the, the community vote. I could always do something like Wild Arms. I could always do something like Yudin or Radiant Historia. I don't really know, and I, I, I don't. I just don't really know, but thankfully I have time until we get through Amori to figure it out. Lots of level up. So you can see the experience. I, I did not plan this. It just happened. I got Kongol's D level 5 with our experience totals that far apart. I was ready to raise Dart off the ground and have him get experience again because everyone caught up. But literally, like... The fight before I was probably going to do that, uh, Congo hit Dragon level 5, so it all worked out so well. Jade Stone. You know, there's other dragons on this tower. I just used up all my magic and all my power on this guy. That means my next Dragoon, I'm not going to be able to just Waffle Stomp him. Eww. Somewhere in this East Country, there's this legend. Life does not come from anywhere or go anywhere. It just goes around with all other lives. It's a great part of a great wheel. I can come back again to the place with light. To the place with warm lives. How can I tell you? But maybe ahead in the hell you sun may fill. There might be a place with light waiting for you. All is up to you. Yes, it is what I have to decide. Where I want to go now. I must think it through. Thank you, Rose. She wasn't even the one fighting. Whoa. This place went like Silent Hill on us. It, like all evaporated. Let's keep going, Dot. Is there anything else here? Hmm. And I don't know of a rest point. Now what I can do is I have quite a lot of these moon serenades that I could pop. However, to give me a little bit of a interesting challenge, I really should use that healing potion on Meru. Yeah, it's okay. Uh, to give myself a little challenge, I think I'm going to wait to use a magic potion until I fully need it. Which is Meru out of MP. You know what I mean? Now let's go ahead and save here. Because Meru is kind of hurt at the moment. Okay, nothing's in there. I wonder how many uh, red herrings there are in this place. Now, the other problem is Dart's addition is not an addition I want to gain SP. So, that's a problem as well. Which is Dart is not... Dart is not in his position to easily gain SP. However, that may be a good thing to raise his additions up. So, is that really a bad thing? I don't know. Mara now has a chance to gain some HP back. Look how fast she is. There we go. I just need to wait for Dart. I realize Congo was hurt. He's only slightly hurt though. Trying to do everything I can to level up his addition naturally as we go.
I mean, I showed I'm definitely strong enough to fight in this area, but that's only when I'm at full power. What if I'm not at full power? How strong am I really? Well, this place is pretty. Here too, the same as the past. She's still a kid. Yes, she was 15 years old back then. She was younger than Meru. She is very, very awesome looking with the blue and the, uh, and the water and just, I, I, she, she does look a lot, a lot like Meru, doesn't she? She really does. Such kids can manage to power dragons. Well, Meru can. Yes, she was born between a human and a mermaid, so that she had a special power. So very powerful with the water affinity. Rose, you were worried and came here to see me. Yes. Thank you, as always. Rose, don't go anywhere. Don't leave me alone again. Oh, the dots. Say something. Rose, you will make me feel lonely like everybody else. No, I won't. There's nobody who was you like this in the past anymore. We won't let them. Yes, Rose and the other dragons are all kind to me. But why make such a sad face? Sorry, Damia, but there is somewhere you have to go. Forgive me. My name almost sounds like Lamia. I wonder if that was intentional. All right, I hate to do this because we're literally fighting. We're literally fighting Meru in a way. I mean, a 15 year old girl, that sounds a lot like Meru, doesn't it? She's also water element, everything like that. It, it's kind, it, it, it is kind of sad to do this. Yes. I'm gonna have Dark yes. jump in here to start building up those additions because he needs them the most. Then the first thing I always want to try to do is do a speed down. Because if we can get the speed down and the power down before she moves, that's ideal. And Congo isn't super fast, so that really helps out. It'd be great if I could. I did see a bee. Yeah, the problem with this fight is she's a water element and darts fire. So, yeah, that's it. Uh, what I want to do is I want to speed up dart. And like I said, the reason for that is so that way he can try to build up additions and SP as fast as possible. Because he is the one that's going to take the longest to build these things up with that horrible 30 point addition. That did a lot of damage. Oh god, that did a lot of damage. Alright, uh, let us power up. Should I power up Congo or Dart? Um, It doesn't really matter. Probably Congo. Although there is a fire water element thing going on here. But I think Congo probably hits harder. Well, let's find out. Yeah, he is a little bit harder. Oh my god, that's a lot of damage. Where the heck did that come from, Congo? Good lord, that hurt. Just, she, she does have Mary's weapon, doesn't she? Giant mace. Oh, this may hurt a lot. So I'm gonna have to defeat seven of these dragoons. No, five. I'm gonna have to defeat five, right? That was pretty. Oh yeah, that one hurt. 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to defeat five because we don't need to defeat Zeke and we don't need to defeat uh, Rose. So that's five total. I don't think I need to heal just yet, but Dart did take a massive shot. Dart took a massive hit there. I can't risk another. I mean, look at them. They look like sisters. It's so uncanny. By the way, praise God to those in um, uh, Florida, Central Florida, uh, East Florida, uh, the Big Bend area. Uh, thoughts and prayers out to you. Um, be safe. Hope everyone is okay. Uh, if you live in that area, like I said, I'm praying for y'all. All right, Dart, um, continue attacking. Okay, I uh, guess I must be back. Yeah. Let's go 100 SP back. Yes. You can go even higher too. I mean, you could go to the 200 SP one and go to 400 with like a worse ash. It's just ridiculous how she gains SP. Not to mention her AOE heal is like the. You could argue it's the second best move in the game. Uh, the best move in the game would be um, Albert's uh, defense spell. Of course, you just had a hit dart. Had a hit dart, didn't you? I wonder if that magic reduction thing works. Got her. Woo! I'm sorry, Damia. Surprised how easy that went. Blue. Oh, I forgot to check the other ring too. Wow, no level ups on that. It's kind of disappointing. Damia, everything will be fine. You won't become lonely anymore. When you go there, everybody will be waiting for you. It's true, I feel, I feel them. Are you coming, Rose? Yes, when the time has come, everybody goes there. Then I'm relieved. See you. Oh, that's kind of sad. It's just a kid for crying out loud. Now, let's go. I mean, if we're being honest, Shauna's not too older. On the base of the water remains, I see some kind of sorrow that makes me think of Dom. What if I miss something in the other area? Sorry if I did. Two more. I wonder if I can get into a fight before you fight the next boss. Although maybe it's a good thing that I'm not using a level one uh, addition on a boss like this. Let's drop a save. There's gotta be something like hidden in these areas. I know I found a Stardust earlier. There's gotta be something else. Overshot it slightly. Uh, let us go ahead and just uh, speed up Dart. This will be a really nice place to get two extra additions.
Plus, I think he's hurt. Because he took that last spell blast. Remember that? It's great that he went third or fourth. Even though he got speed up. Yeah, let's let's try to heal Dart up a little. Do I need to use my magic yet? I, I have one more AoE heal, I think. And with one more AoE heal, I think we can do at least one more dragoon. And then we can pop an MP up on all. And then we can fight the last two dragons. Look at that. Mary is so fast. It was speed up. She took her turn. <laughs> yeah, speed down is so good. Really nukes an enemy. Okay, I'm ready to attack now. I just want Dart to attack. Maybe he's getting like infinite turns down there. Final edition, Blazing Dynamo. Hopefully it has a 100 SP gain. It does. Ooh, a 250 base damage percent. That's really nice. It's not as strong as Moonstrike, but it's as strong as Volcano. And it'll probably go up to what? 300% damage or 350% damage by the time it's done? I mean, if you look at Kongles, uh, Bone Crush is infinitely better than anything else. I mean, 300% damage at 100 SP. I think all of the final moves have... Nope. Stand corrected. Flower Storm does not have 100 SP. Neither does Omni Sweep. Most of them do. Yeah, most of them do. All right, who's up next? Here too, the same as the past. He is, oh, it's our Kongol. Children. I will realize the freedom you wished in the future I promise to you. Children, please watch us. Is that the, is that still one of the dragoons that is trapped in this world? Yes, his name is Belzac. He is a dragon recognized by the Golden Dragon Spirit. You know, that's the Earth one that you got confused by, and I just missed a line of dialogue, and I don't like that. But, what is trying him to this world? Is that you, Rose? And Zeke! Uh, not really. No, it seems not. Who are you? It is a long story. We don't have time to tell you about it now. Yes, indeed. The subjugation of Contessa will be soon. The last strategy has to be completed for the sake of the children who were killed by Winglings. You haven't realized it yet? Realized what? You are... No, not only you, but everybody but me has died. Well, so you guys died? Everybody has died, and that includes me? Shirley died too? Oh wait, if Shirley is one of the group and she's outside, then that means I only have to defeat four dragons, not five, unless Shirley is the secret ultimate uh, boss in this area. It, it cannot be. I took the attack of Supervised with my own body to be the shield for Shirley. Oh, you remember now. No way, I don't believe Shirley died. I don't believe it! Okay, well he's attacking me instead of the other way around. And if this guy is like Congo, then he's probably going to hurt. Yeah, I mean look at the size of the axe. He's probably going to hurt. Gosh. 
shoot, what am I doing? I know I need to build up SP, but that's not my first move that I should have done. That is definitely not my first move I should have done. I should have done the speed down, I should have done power down, and now I'm gonna get absolutely blocked. Did you just summon the dragon on me? Wow. Dude just punched an asteroid and created meteors. I have no idea if, if that's scientifically true what I just said, but I don't care. That was amazing. That was incredible. So cool. All right, let, let's try to shut this guy down a little. Speed down into a power down. Into more speed gainage. Unless I miss. Okay, I'm pretty good at hers. And for some reason, he is super fast. Okay, I'm getting a little bit worried. Uh, I'm getting a little bit worried here. Uh, plan flightless. I can't. I only have one more heal, so I can't do it right now. Come on, Flightless. You're better than that. I'm have you defend. I know that's the opposite thing of what I need to do right now, but... Okay, he's still hitting like a truck. Why is this guy so dang fast? He is so fast. Oh, he just summoned the dragon on me. Oh, no, you did not. I'm glad I defended with a uh, dart. I'm glad I didn't cast my heal yet because I'm going to need it right about now. No, I mean, that that wasn't so bad. That was not so bad. Uh, let's have you defend again. And Meru, let's have you defend as well. Didn't even get a turn with Congo. This guy is amazingly fast. like infinite turns. I attacked one time and he gets an extra turn. to do I I can't I don't think I can it's only blue yeah I can't heal right now I can't I do her I can't do her addition all of a sudden it's kicking my butt
Ooh, I like the kick. Ooh, I like the spin. Everything about that was amazing, except the fact it did like zero damage. I think I need a special, but I need her to do her stupid addition, which I can't seem to do. There we go. Let's go. All right, much better. Obviously, I do not want to do the the, uh, the special with with him. And as much as I love to hear the yippee sounds, I think I'm gonna do a special with Dart. That way, she can heal. My speed is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Oh my god, why did that do so much damage? Why? I could killing rain here. Guys, kicking my butt. Like seriously, kicking my butt. I don't know if this works on bosses, but let's use on Angle because he's the slowest. I can't special with him. That's a really bad idea. I can speed up Dark Doe. Try to get his turn back as fast as possible. Perfect. Let's go. Super Saiyan mode time. This guy is by far the hardest of the ones I've fought. Yeah, straight up attack. Absolutely. I have not been able to put any damage on this guy. I'm doing no damage at all. To you, Kyle. It's like no damage, though. I'm not hurting this guy. I'm not hurting this guy at all. Okay, that did significantly less damage because I've been dragging him for him. But like I said, I need to do damage to this guy or else I'm gonna get completely destroyed. Let's see if this does more damage. Which sucks because if it does, then I need to use magic attacks on him and I don't have any way to reliably use magic attacks right now. Yep, magic damage is the way to go. But unfortunately, I don't have access to magic because I'm basically out. I do have access to magic with Meru. The problem is though, while I'm under fire, it's gonna do significantly less. Uh, so I kinda need to wait for Dart to run out. Um, yeah, I kinda need to wait for Dart to run out. Missed. Yeah. 
This fight would be a lot easier if I used the uh, the MP restorative. Instead, I made this fight ten times harder than what it had to be. Yeah, I made this fight ten times harder than it had to be. It's fine. Oh my god, he's still only blue. It is not fine. This is not fine. Hey, it may not do a lot of damage, but at least I'm getting some fun yet peace. <laughs> this is a grueling fight. And unfortunately, I special, which means I can't use an MP restorative. Like, so many... So many mistakes for me. So many mistakes were made in this fight. Just you wait, buddy. Just you wait. Once I get out of this special, which normally is a good thing, but this time I kind of screwed myself. I'm gonna kick your tail. Is that three yippies in a row? In bowling, we call that what? Uh, what do you call that? Um, a turkey? Three strikes in a row? Oh, that did a lot of damage. That was not cool. But you do- I don't know if your magic is stronger, but you do do- You do do, uh, about a thousand damage. So, yeah, let, let's get that thousand damage. Keep going. Was not a thousand damage. Why was that not a thousand damage? Fortunately, she's gonna break out. Four in a row? Darn it. Okay, well, this is a good thing because now I can try to get some magic back. Unfortunately, Dart is a prime candidate to use that magic, and he's gonna run out of special. Disappointing. Because I did a speed up, it kind of ruined all my strategies. I did a speed up, I did a special, I did everything wrong because I didn't have the magic to follow up. Okay, you need, uh, SP. Another meteor strike. Problem is, with all these attacks he's doing, I'm gonna have to use some of my mana to heal. But thankfully, like, her main attack that is, is only like 10%. I mean, uh, 10 mana. Yeah, 
that one hurt. That one hurt a little. Do I need a heal? Probably, because this guy can do like 12. Come on! I don't know why it's so fast. So wait, if he goes again, I'll be mad. Uh, Mary needs some help, but unfortunately, Congo can't help. Mare is a speed demon, and yet, look at that. This guy got three attacks before she even moved. What the heck, man? Like, seriously, what the heck? She's still alive somehow. I need her turn, is what I need. I need her to move. That's bull crud. That is so bull crud. She hasn't moved and he's gotten like four or five attacks. Like, what the heck? Like, honestly, what the heck? I only have two of these. Frustrating battle because A, this guy is so much stronger than anything else we fought here. So, so, so much stronger. But also, not only is he so much stronger and faster, the only way I can really punch him is through magic. It's like, I only get one turn and then he gets turned. Then I get one turn and then he gets a turn. Now I get one turn and then he gets a turn. It's not how things should work. Not with the speed of this team. I think it was doing one damage before because it was under power up. That would explain a lot. Um, I need to hit him. Yes, I need to be able to heal. That was clutch right there. Because I need to be able to heal and in order to do that, I needed her to get to SP level 1, or Dragon level 1. Okay, I need you to continue to attack, because even though I'd love to you to use your magic attack, I also need to be able to get you to heal if needed. I know I can always rewind that, but that's not how I would like to play. I don't like to cheat the system and just rewind when I mess up. That's That takes the fun out of things. And this is his most powerful attack, isn't it? This is the one that does like 16 damage. No, it's not. The, the, the physical attack is the one that does the most. 
This is what, 300, 400? Yeah, uh, I can live with that. It's when he goes again, he gets about to his knee. Nope, okay, cool. All right, uh, we got one more attack. Like, I, oh man, I totally missed that one. Only 100 less damage than normal, though, so that's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. This is fine. This is, this is fine. I miss it so badly with her, and it is really hurting me. Like, it is really hurting me, missing constantly with her attacks. Now we got the Tink Buster. The one thing I'm really afraid of is that attack that just does a ridiculous amount of damage. Do I SP now? Yes, he's in the red. Definitely, definitely dragon form here. And return fire. That's what I needed. Man, this this fight could have been so much easier. So much easier if I had just used magic at the beginning. That's 100%. That's only 50. I don't need to use the dragon, the dragon yet. Need that damage. Hurt, but so is he. Maybe I'll bring him down here. Please go down. Please go down. Now, while the dragons you fought, you are by far the absolute worst. I think he's down because we're undragooning. Oh my lord, that was tough. Yeah, I still think I checked the stones. I need to do that.
Now I remember all the truth. But death is not as sad as I imagined. Thank you, Bugs. Oh, he gave me a run for my money. It's not sad anymore. Yes, the surely left is there too. Let's keep going. Let's check these stones. Should have sorted it. I think these are them. So I remember Jade. So they all reduce damage by a certain type. Yeah, they all reduce damage by a certain type. <sighs> Dart is messed up. Alright, what? We got one more fight? Possible fifth fight with uh Shirley? I don't know if I'm ready for this fight, though. I mean, I am a wee bit injured. When I say a wee bit injured, I mean very, very, very injured. <laughs> well, not so much. Didn't save. I didn't save before coming in here. Here, too, the same as the past. Great, the lightning one. Oh, this is going to be horrible. Who is it? Oh, it's you. You hate this place so much. What made you change your mind about coming here? I did change my mind. These dolls still make me feel nauseous. Heh, <laughs> say what you want. These are my mentors to remind me of the taste of blood to be from my fist. There is no reason to be criticized by you. The people killed by you won't be saved if they find a momentum with such poor taste as their tomb. You came here to become one of these dolls. I now understand the reason why you're clinging to this world. You haven't killed enough. Wow. Then let me be satisfied with you. Oh, great. Got a serial dragoon killer. And he's lightning helmet, which is like not weak to anything, I think. Speed down. And he still goes first. Or second, whatever. Kamehameha! I've never seen a uh, Hashel's full dragoon sequence. I guess that's what it looks like. It looks pretty awesome. And it hurts! That really hurt! Like, super duper hurt. That hurt too, though. It's good to have the big man around. Didn't even take him out of blue, though. I love his addition. It looks so cool. Especially that kick he does. It's really neat. No, I'm not happy about that. I'm not happy at all. Yeah, that did significantly less damage to him. That's so cheap. When that red appears there, it is impossible to finish the combo. I I'm not joking, it's literally impossible. It it the combo just ends because there it is impossible to hit that third button uh, when the second button is red. It is literally impossible.
don't know what's wrong with me. I don't know what's wrong with me. Ah, uh, it's annoying. Um, do I special here? There's no reason not to special here. The bottom line is I get a final burst off. Did not do enough damage. Let's try again. See, it's impossible. It's literally impossible to do that. The Thunder God cometh. Thunder God attack. Literally, Thunder God. Thankfully hit dark. I'm okay with that. It's probably the best person you could have hit. Yeah, that's by far the best person you could have hit. Are you kidding me? Again, very lucky. Very, 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 very lucky. Okay, she's ready to fire off her heal. You can hit Congo all you want. This guy's a tank. Attack. Never really understood how to do those. It just doesn't seem to line up right. Or it's gotta be like pixel perfect or something. Really, really. Hard to do. Uh, is he doing his ultimate on me now? Now is not a good time to do his ultimate. I need to heal Meru. Okay, he's not doing his ultimate. Oh wait, this may be his ultimate. Maybe single target. What the? Oh my god. Explosion! That is ridiculous, and it's amazing at the same time. That was so cool. All right, now we need to heal. I can't transform Congo because if I need someone to use items. He's the only one who can at the moment. The only problem with that though is he's, he's really slow, so. I like it when he hits Congo. Uh, yeah, let, let's hit him with your best attack.
Got him. All right. Whew. Like I said, the other one was the worst. That was so strong. Hey, and what do you know? The only one to level up was Hashel, who is the lightning one. I was surprised when you joined the campaign by being persuaded by Shirley. But after all, it was to kill. Yes, that's right. Was that the only reason? I thought the noble instance Shirley, which I could never have, would take me somewhere I could otherwise never know. Some bright place I couldn't know, so even after death, I have been looking for that place. The bright place. I hope we can reach there. Let's keep going. Uh, Kansas was seeking salvation. That's the reason why he decorated the divine tree in this way. Hmm. Okay. Oh, I think I'm back at the beginning. Yeah, I'm back at the beginning. I did a full loop. So now the question is, do I have to fight Shirley here? Man, look at the time differences. I literally spent so much time killing sandworms. It's ridiculous. Let's uh, go ahead and let Dart power up his addition some. So where's Shirley at? I feel refreshed. I wonder if the healing power of Shirley still remains here. Wait, I could have come back here any time to get myself healed? Are you kidding me? Oh, that would have been nice to know. But where's Shirley at? Like, is that the end of this? I think that's the end of this, my friends. All right, well, let me know in the comment section below if I miss anything. Because if I did, I'm gonna stop here for the day. Uh, and uh, if I miss anything, it's very easy just to go back and make sure I get the thing I'm supposed to get. But for now, I love you all so very much. I hope you have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day. Uh, I would like to know your uh, advice on how to best spend my 24,000 gold. Yeah, that would be cool as well. So, yeah, sign off on the comment section below. Uh, how, 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 how did you guys do on those fights? Did you make the same dumb mistake that I did and went physical attack of the giant rock lobster guy? Or did you be smart enough and use spells? Yeah, I should have used spells. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day. And I will talk to you again very soon. Until then, so long. And take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself 
Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.